Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be talking about all the Glam Glow masks in the Glam Glow line. The only mask that I don't have to show you guys is the kind of eye mask, which eh, never really intrigued me anyway. Um, but I do have all of the Glam Glow mask here, which I believe there's only four. I hope there's only four, because I'm only going to talk about these four. I know that I've mentioned them a couple times in favorites videos, but I've never given you like my full thoughts on them. So I just wanted to do that today because I do get a lot of questions on the Glam Glow masks. So we're going to start off with the black one first, which I believe is the first Glam Glow mask to come out with. And this is the Youth Mud Tingle Exfoliant. And I will say really quickly why it's not my favorite. It's only because I've never really noticed a difference in my skin when I've used this mask. And I feel like if you don't notice a difference, then what's the point in using it? Now that could just be only me. I'm pretty sure that this did win a beauty award, so I, it just could be me and my weirdo skin, but I just never have really noticed a difference in my skin. This is kind of supposed to be like a little 10 minute facial in a jar. It does feel really nice on your face, um, but afterwards, like I said, I don't really notice a huge difference in it. It's supposed to leave your skin glowing and radiant and, I mean, I don't want to ever bash a product because I realize that different things work for different people. I'm just letting you guys know that I've never really noticed a difference in my skin when using this little guy. So I don't really have a ton of things to say about him because I have used him probably the least out of all the masks. This is a smaller sample size that you can find it at Sephora and this would be the normal size that it came in. I don't really have much to say about him. If you had a positive experience with the Youth Mud Tingle Mask, please leave your comments down below so that other people reading the comments can see. Maybe I can try it and it'll be different for my skin than it is for Nicole. So next is the Glam Glow Super Mud Clearing Treatment. This I love. So this is a brand new one. I just picked him up from Sephora like three days ago, so I haven't even broken into him. I was a little hesitant to try the clearing treatment because I wasn't really super impressed with the Youth Mud one, but I was like, let me try it. It may be a little different, and I'm so glad that I did because this is actually one of my favorite masks that I've ever used. So you put it on like a regular mask, and this is going to help kind of correct any damage on your skin. It's going to help prevent breakouts. It's going to clear breakouts. It is going to help declog your pores, which is going to help make them seem smaller. It helps helps the effects of scarring on your face, kind of diminishing them. It's just a really great mask to me. So you put this on, you leave it on for about 10-15 minutes. There's lots of acids in this actual mud mask. There's like glycolic acid, there's salicylic acid, there's lactic, lactic, lactic acid, lactic acid. Mm. All that good stuff will be down below. There's peppermint plant in here, which is going to help fight irritation of the skin. Just a lot of really good things. So this is part of my pre-flight rituals. I like to apply this to my face a couple days before I know I'm going to fly on a plane. I don't really like to do it so much the night before because sometimes this can cause a breakout just because it's pulling all the dirt and everything out of your face. So obviously it has to come to the surface and develop into a blemish. I like to apply this a couple of days and just really cleanse my skin, get everything out of it, really clear it up. And then I'll follow it with the Thirsty Mud, which will be talking about in a second. So um, this is definitely one of my most favorite masks there is. I like to use it anytime I feel like, you know, when it's that time of the month and we tend to break out. That's mainly when I like to use it. Otherwise, I wait until I'm traveling or something. Also, you can use this as a spot treatment, which I love to do if you just get like this huge, you know, like unicorn growing out of the front of your head. You can just, you know, do a little dab, a little spot treatment, and I like to sleep with it overnight. And when I wake up in the morning, it's like completely flat. So this really is a holy grail to me. I absolutely love it. And again, this is the super mud clearing treatment so the next one is probably my favorite out of all of the masks that I've tried from Glam Glow. If you've watched my favorite videos, you've seen me mention this. This is the Glam Glow Thirsty Mud Hydrating Treatment, which I am just, I can't, mm. Like, I don't know where this has been my whole life. I can't imagine what I would do without it. So like the name says, Thirsty Mud, it is a hydrating treatment for your face. It is a non-drying mask that it delivers really intense hydration to your skin. It really moisturizes your skin, it replenishes your skin, and it calms your skin. It is just so, so amazing. This is the duo part that I use when I do kind of my before I fly treatment. So I'll apply this first to kind of just pull everything out of my face, and then to calm it down and soothe the irritation and really lock moisture into my face. I use the Thirsty Mud. It smells... Oh, I can't even tell you what it smells like. It just gives your skin this like super glowy, youthful looking look to it. I don't even know like how to explain like how good or how much I'm in love with the Thirsty Mud mask. I use it 
almost every single night. I just love how it feels on my face. I just really like to have a moisturized face because when your face is moisturized, it's more plump, it's more filled, you don't really see fine lines in your face and anything like that. So I'm all about moisturizing and hydrating your skin. So this, if I had to tell you to pick any of the masks that I'm about to talk about, this would be the one that I would tell you, go get it. Okay, moving on to the last and newest mask from Glam Glow. This is the Power Mud Dual Cleanse Treatment. And this one is a mud to oil, gentle, deep, clean kind of mask to really cleanse your skin of like weekly buildup of makeup. This is great if you're someone like me and you just wear a lot of makeup on a regular basis. I don't know if you're filming YouTube videos or what you're doing, girl, but if you wear a lot of makeup and you just like to do a deep clean, this is a great mask for that. So when it dries on your face, it dries regularly like a mud mask would, but then when you start to wash it off your face it kind of transforms into an oil which makes it a lot easier to remove from your face and the oil in it is really just restoring your skin helping tone it it's replenishing it just all the good things that oils do for your skin just locked into a mud mask which when it's the mud mask is helping to really cleanse your face and get rid of that weekly buildup that you know, pollution makeup anything causes it offers a really deep cleansing formula but it's also super gentle at the same time because all the oils that are packed into this i've tried tons and tons of masks and these honestly are a few of my favorites that i have ever tried they're just really luxurious on your skin i do notice such a big difference in my skin when i do use these two masks i wouldn't rave about them if i didn't think they were absolutely amazing i like to mix um mix it up when i'm like cleansing because this is like a clearing treatment so i really like to use this for spot treatments or anything like that and this one i use on a weekly basis just to kind of like i said cleanse my skin and get rid of any buildup that's been happening throughout the week. So I hope this video helped you kind of break down which mask you think would be better suited for you because I know it's kind of hard to distinguish what mask you should use and if it's going to be beneficial for you or not. So yeah, I don't think I have anything else to tell you guys. Um, I will be back on Studio 10. Remember, I linked you guys before. I will be back on Studio 10 July 24th, which is next Thursday. It is live and it is at 9 in the morning. Oh girl and I will be out of town this weekend so um, there will be no videos over the weekend I'm going to Jersey to see my baby mama Carly Bible and Jeremy's boyfriend Brett Cap. <laughs> I don't think I have anything else to say except I love you guys thank you so much for watching and until next time I will talk to you guys soon bye what the hell go oh, all oh. So cheesy. Yeah. <laughs> Be talking. So we're gonna go all over. <laughs> it showed you. <laughs> Moving on to the last mask. Last mask. I said last. <laughs> Yellow. When you put it on, it is no. I don't even know. I only have one earring on. Where's my other earring? <laughs>